All right, this is your mama 757 coupon, and I'm coming at you, yes, late, late, super late, with um my, I think, I don't know if I'm going to do a whole lot of transactions. Well, I did a whole lot of transactions, but I don't think I'm going to do more. I might go to the store. I might, don't, I don't know. Guys, I wasn't going to do no clearance, but everybody know that tissue is my weakness, right? So I will question myself, should I do this? Or show y'all or should I not? And the reason why is because at my store, these was wrong up as discontinued. Okay? The Scott tissue was wrong up as discontinued. Um, these 8 equal 10 was wrong up as discontinued. These 12 um, cotton nails were wrong up as discontinued. This was wrong up as discontinued at my store. But then when I went to another store... It wrong up as pending discontinued. Now, this was the only thing that actually, well, un only paper product that actually just wrong up for the clearance price. This wrong up for four fifty. Okay, so when I went to another store, it wrong up as pending discontinued, and to sell it at regular price. Um, but it's a pending discontinued item. So that being said, you might be lucky to get some. You might not. Some stores say hopefully that their system will upgrade or whatever the case may be, and this stuff will ring up for the um for the clearance price. So hopefully, I'm crossing my fingers that we we will be able to get these for the regular clearance price. Now, at some stores, some stores say it was ringing up for that that half off price without nobody keying at the end or anything it was just ringing it up it was ringing up but at my store they had to mark it down but it, this was a discontinued item this wrong up as discontinued um this wrong up as discontinued this wrong up for the price they didn't have to adjust it at all um this wrong up as discontinued and all of these wrong up as discontinued and they just adjusted the price okay now for stuff like this None of these had to be keyed in. None of these had to be adjusted or anything. Uh, none of my detergents, none of my Febreze, none of my uh, Ajax, none of these had to be adjusted. The price just wrong up. That's the great thing about it. Okay. Also, for the Palmolin, that wrong up. The um, Don um, Simple and Clean wrong up. The, wait a minute, the Suave. Um, one minute. I'm in shea butter. Wrong up. Okay, so I'm gonna just go quickly with um the prices of this stuff. <laughs> the prices of some of this stuff, anyway. Okay, that wrong up for four fifty. Okay, and then I'm gonna just show you some of my receipts. I, I guess because everybody likes seeing receipts. Okay, <laughs> that wrong up for four fifty right here. This wrong up for three, I would like to say it was 375 or maybe cheaper, but 375 for these. Same as this one, 375. I think it was probably a little cheaper than that, to be honest. Okay, these won't go for a dollar and 30, um, a dollar and 35 cent. Now, for these, I use a 50 cent pilly that I found at Family Dollars. Um, these I use a 50 cent coupon that was in our February 10th. Um, retail me not. I did not use a coupon for this. Okay, this I use a dollar digital. Um, I had um, used several accounts and used a dollar digital. This one I used that 50 cent coupon that was in the February 10th. Retail me not. This one I used a dollar off coupon that was in the February 10th. Retail me not. That's also, um, a, this is ringing up a dollar and five cent. Okay, these I used my three dollar digitals. These are ringing up two dollars and seventy cent. This one was ringing up a dollar and thirty five cent. I used the uh, digital. Now you can use your BOGO coupon, but you will not get overage. If you use the digital coupon, you will get overage because it would take the whole three dollars off. So I would advise you to use your three dollar digital. This one was uh, in the February twenty second. Smart source. Was the two dollars off coupon for the Airwick? This is ringing up a dollar and eighty-seven cent. These are ringing up three dollars. I did not have a coupon. Did I use a coupon? Okay, let me see where else I'm at. Okay, okay. These dons are ringing up for thirty-seven cent. 
I used um, the 25 cent coupon that was in our PG, our March PG. These I used the three dollars off a of two coupon for these. I think they ringing up a dollar and fifty cent if I'm not mistaken. Okay, and I want you to see those two different ones right here. Okay, this one right here is the Gain on um, Moonlight Breeze. This is ringing up seventy five cent. This, these right here, I'm not mistaken. I think it ringing up seventy five cent for the Ajax. Okay, this is ringing up three dollars and sixty cent. I use a coupon that was in our January, no, not January, in our February twenty fourth on um, Smart Source, and made them sixty cent. Woo! I'm getting old. Y'all, whoa! I had to sit down to get down here. Okay. This one wrong up, I think, a dollar and some change. But I had a 75 cent off coupon. Um, and it says for 21 ounces or larger, but for some reason it would not scan for this. But the lady just manually keyed it in because it is 28 ounces. Okay. Oh, by the way, this wrong up as a discontinued item, but um it's still wrong up as the 395, so they just had to do the price, you know. You know, price this down, and I used that four off of two coupon that was on the digital. Now, some stores said that they are ringing up for the clearance price, so I'm hoping that today, some when well, it's after midnight, so I'm hoping that when I go to the store today, I won't have that issue. Okay, now the palm model, which I'm mad at myself because we have 50 cent coupons and I forgot all about them. Okay, I, we have 50 cent coupons, and I um, February 20th. Fourth, um, smart source, but I forgot all about them. These are ringing up 90 cent. If I would have used the 50 cent coupon, it would have been on the 40 cent, but I had forgot all about them. So I got those. Now, this right here is a penny item. This won't up for a penny. I want you to get a good look at it. Okay, and here is the school number for that. That wrong up a penny. Okay, and then this also right here, wrong up a penny. Okay, and I want to also give you the school number on that. Okay, so now I'm just going to show you some receipts real quick so you can kind of get a rough estimate of how I was doing my transaction. So, how pretty much how I was doing my transaction, I was basically using all my freebies, my overage, and taking a complete advantage of that. Like, a little bit of overage from the Febreze. I used that for the palm modeling, paid only 60 cents for three items. You cannot beat that 20 cent item. Who gonna argue about that? Okay. Um, Like with this one, this one was a bigger transaction. Um, the Swab Coupon... It's the three off of two. I can't remember what uh, answer because I did not get those coupons. Gemini Butterfly actually send them send me those coupons, those three off of two, and they expire on the third. So that's the coupons that I use um, for these. And I cannot remember what insert they came out of because I did not, you know, I did not receive that coupon. So this this woo, I'm sorry. These are ringing up a dollar and thirty five cent. I used that three off of two coupon for that. It gave me a little bit of overage. Okay. Now you see the how I was able. I got the plugs. I wanted you to see that the plugs won't up for a penny, and also the kids night quit won't up before a penny. Okay. So the quitting over also wrong up. These are items that they didn't have to override. Everything wrong up as they were supposed to, and. I use all my coupons. I use my overage. Um, I also use what my three dollars off. I'm trying to see did my three yeah my three dollars off a two for the Febreze came. Um, everything came off. So I paid um three dollars and forty two cent for fourteen items. And you see that's a saving of fifteen. That's fourteen items saving fifteen dollars and fifty cent. So you can't beat that. That's how it's a great example of how I was doing my transaction. Okay. Now, I did pay some big money because I, I'm going to show you those two receipts last. Because I did get the cotton in, like I said, 
since I saved so much with this, like I said, I sold a few bundles. This just so I can shop, you know. <laughs> so please don't think I'm breaking the bank when I go coupon like that. No, I'm not. I sell this stuff just so I can shop. So okay, um, as you can see, I have been able to do the chic razors and some Febreze. The um. This, what is it? The soft soap, the Ajax. I did all of that. And then I think with this one, I actually had one of those $5 um, PG coupon because I saved all my $5 PG coupon and I was able to find more on the ground. People would just toss them on the ground and I saved them all just for the do deals like this. This one, I had a $5 PG, I think, coupon on it. I think. I'm not sure. But um, at the end, my total was just a dollar and 69 cents. Okay, let me see with this one. If you do have those PG coupon, just remember they expire tomorrow. Okay, so go ahead and use them. So this one, I got the Quilt Normal, which was this, this one. I got two of those. They override the price, as you can see. Um, and made the price, marked it down to $3.75. And I got two of those. And then I got two of the Airwick on oil refill. Not oil refill. The auto sprays. They were a dollar and eighty-seven cent. I got two of those. And then I got the Don. Okay. And I did not have no more coupons for the Don, but you can't beat 37 cent. So I paid six dollars and sixty-seven sixty-one cent. Think about this. Six dollars and sixty-one cent is just for the price. It's is less. It's less than the price of one of these tissues, original price. Because this is original price at $7.50. And I'm trying to understand, why is the Quit and Nova is so high? I, I still don't understand that. I need to actually use it. Because I actually haven't used the Quit and Nova. I don't know. But I need to use it and see if it's going to make my my bum feel magnificent or something. I don't know what it's supposed to do to my bum. But I got to see. Okay. So, um, this one, I got two of the Febreze. And one of the women and one of the women is soft soap body wash. That's what it was. And then I just used all my digital and my total ended up being five cent because of the overage. And it basically covered the thirty five cent for the um soft soap. So that's pretty much what I I've been doing. Um I'm gonna show you my bit receipt because I know y'all said, Well, how much you pay for all that tissue? But I want you to see all the savings I did with this. I didn't care about paying for the tissue. Okay, so this one right here, um, I got the Paul Marlin, the White Smells, the Shea Moisture, I mean not Shea Moisture, the Suave Conditioner and Shampoo, and the Paul Marlin, and then my total ended up being a dollar and twenty cent. Which if I would have you thought about using no fifty cent coupons, I would have been under a dollar. Like that's why I'm mad about. Like if I would have used those fifty cent coupons, my total would have been only twenty cent. Like how could I? not thought about the 50 cent coupons like what was wrong with me <laughs> like that's crazy i forgot about that okay so then after that um this was the moonlight i think i got the moonlight the chic razor i got a whole bunch of stuff on this one a whole lot of dime on um, some ajac i got i got a whole lot and then my total came up to two dollars and twelve cent with that one and then this one right here, I think I got um the soft soap and two of the Febreze products, but I think I got the fabric spray instead on one of them. That's why my total was a little higher. It was twenty seven cent. So this is like an example on how you can you know get your total down. Now for the toilet paper, I got ten of the cotton there. Yes, I did. I got whole ten. Ten of the cotton there. Uh, I think I can submit this on Fetch. People say something about fetch, and I know with the Airwick pro, I mean the Airwick products, I think they got snuggle on one of them, and I can put that on saving star. I'm gonna try to see if it worked, but anyway, I spent thirty because I said all the savings I was doing, I didn't mind spending the money, and and even with this, the savings is thirty dollars. Like I saved half my money. Okay, so with this one, all the Scots. And, you know, I got the Snuggle Lavender. They they marked that down because it was, you know. But all the items end up being 25 So, majority of my money went towards the toilet paper. 
And guess what? I already got six bundles to do and it's not going to even take a fraction of this stuff away from me. <laughs> Like, I actually have sold some bundles just a coupon. Like, that's crazy. That shows I have a problem. But anyway, um, this is Short Mama 757. Oh, I'm telling y'all, please follow me at Short Mama 757 Coupon on Instagram. Please like, comment, subscribe. Please follow me on Instagram and like, share, and do all the things that they'll both tell you to do at the end of the video. I might post this tomorrow after I get probably some more tissue if i can find a store as long as it don't say pending and hopefully it just say discontinue now if it say discontinue i don't have a problem at any of my stores if it say discontinue they will automatically give me the markdown price but if it's a pending discontinue they can't really do nothing because even the, the things say you know you really can't mess with it so i'm just hoping that i have some luck y'all wish me luck and, and go ahead and talk about me in the comment section about how many how much pro, how many problems I have with this coupon and I need to be in some kind of class. Yeah. Anyway, bye.